ladies and gentlemen, Mary Patrick, myself, Georgia. Uh, tonight I just have a few questions about some of the county procedures and policy. First one is, I was just wondering when y'all voted to uh, approve checks on the check register per your policy. Uh, it's my understanding that they're all being approved now or signed, auto-signed, whatever you want to call it, and your policy states at the Board of Commissioners meeting the check register will be approved by the commissioners for payments, and I have never yet seen that on the agenda nor seen a vote approving that. So I was just wondering when that might happen so that we can have some oversight and accountability and follow those procedures. Number two... Just wondering when uh, you might have approved the loss agreement with the city and when it took effect. I know Ms. Smith's been up here several times and Mr. Alexander said several times about the agreement. And I noticed that the library's been open seven days a week now, but I've never heard or seen where anybody's ever approved that agreement that was signed or authorized to be signed or voted on. And the last thing is, after looking through the agenda, I was just wondering how the says that the county manager may serve as the uh, person on the EMS committee for the board of commissioners. And I was just wondering how the county manager might be a facilitator as well as be a member of that board representing the commissioners, because I had... I can understand being a member, but I'd always thought that a facilitator would be fair and impartial, wouldn't have any loyalties one way or the other. So you might want to consider that. And if somebody might at some point in time let me know the answers to the questions, I appreciate it. 